All right, hello everybody. My name is Cats Games. Welcome to episode two of Luigi's Mansion 3. This is getting recorded right after the first one because I just cannot wait to play more of this game. Another episode. I hope you guys are enjoying it so far, even though it's the first episode. It's kind of the prologue, so there's more cutscenes than really gameplay. Now we're going to get into gameplay because we actually have a map now. Yay, it looks disgusting, in my opinion. This is probably the worst thing about this game, is this menu, this virtual boy thing. Everyone complains how the console is just red, it's eye straining, it looks like shit. And guess what? They use that concept of their shittiest console to make a fucking whole menu about this console. Should have used the DS or the 3DS. Ah! Anyways. It looks like shit in my opinion. I don't know if the game, when, when you progress in the game, it like gives you a different one. I, I sure hope fucking does. Because I don't want to look at this <laughs> the rest of the game. It's so annoying. Well, that did nothing. Like in the first game, you had the fucking Game Boy. And I thought that was fucking dope. Okay, so our objective from the last episode is... Um, is to go to the elevator. And install the tracker. Now what the tracker does, I don't know. I think it maybe downloads data of every floor or some shit. Look, I, I, I couldn't tell you. Where is the crack? Well, it's in my ass, but there was a crack where we looked and there was a painting of coins. We actually can get some money here as because we saw money here at the start, but we couldn't go here. I can actually push this. Out the way. Hmm, I wonder how you get that gem. I actually don't know. Can I turn this valve? Oh, I can. Well, that just gives me money. It doesn't cause an explosion or anything. God damn. Okay, 4,000. That's about all the money we're gonna get here. Oh god, get over here. Yeah, spiders can harm me in this as well, so we gotta fucking kill these cons. I hate spiders. Alright, so... When I play this game... I was streaming it, and no one was paying attention to the game, and neither was I. So, this is kind of cool, and now I get actually informed on what, what, what is what. Because the EGA loves to talk so fucking much. Hello Luigi, it seems like the installation was successful. Now then, as to what the device actually does, well, it extracts map data. Oh, I was right. About the floors from the elevator. Then it takes all that data and displays it on the monitor. Isn't that great? Uh, why don't you take those elevator buttons... Oh yeah, we did get elevator buttons and insert them into the panel. <laughs> Look, I did this shit like 10 minutes ago and I already forgot. Oh, yeah. Here we go. <clears throat> ah, it's a snake. Ah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Luigi. Now you're able to view the map of the new floor. There's another surprise, Luigi. This device links with Virtual Boo. The map data is automatically sent to the VB, so you can view the map anywhere, anytime. If you open the map from the VB menu, you can check out even more detailed map. The map is super helpful for exploring new floors. Uh, those boons will let you reach new floors. Uh, arrive for exploration. Oh, and you might find your friends. <laughs> One more thing, Luigi. We need to do a quick test of the communication system. Open VB and press plus. Got it. EGAT hotline. Testing, testing, one, two, three. This is EGAT, resident genius. Am I coming through loud and clear? Fantastic. It appears the VEB's communication system is working perfectly. That means you can use this to contact me anytime you need to. If you feel the need to talk to me, just do exactly what you did for the test, okay, Luigi? Uh, you can also check out logs. Test my new invention is fun, but we should get back to work. And speaking of work, I have a job for you. You're able to go to the fifth floor now. I, I was actually staying in that floor, and there's a briefcase of mine. Can you get it, Luigi? Uh, my room number is... Oh, wait, what was it? Oh, you got a map. You'll figure it out. Good luck, Luigi. Try to come back alive. Hey, I, I'm kind of skipping his dialogue because it's very long. Um, and kind of trying to summarize it for you guys. So, now we can talk to Egat. Which I'm not gonna do. Because <laughs> I don't like talking to him. He's kind of weird. So we have floor one and floor five. Now we got the map data. So this is about the area where I stopped playing the game. Um, so pretty much everything from here is gonna be new. Also, apologies for any flickers or something. I have a very cheap capture card. <laughs> 
So that happens. Okay, that leads to down there. Yeah. Oh. All right, let's go upstairs here. I don't think we were up here. I think we just went straight through that door. I remember finding this when I like I found this like first time I was on this floor. There's something down here, but I don't know how to get there. I remember in discovering this, I was like, I'm a fucking genius. There's really nothing there for now. Oh, there's rats. And a gem. <gasps> it's a spider. Oh, drops money. It's just like the rats from the first game. I don't think there's anything here. We can't go here for some reason. I'm really curious if we're gonna see any ghosts from the first game. All right, let's go here. Um, I wonder if there's actual new areas we can go. Of course, as you can see on the map, that's that's the room we saw through the crack. If I can fucking go to the right floor, right here. How do you get there? I might know. <laughs> I might figure it out. Oh, there's ghosts here. Come on. Um, so the room's here. Behind this wall. How do you get there, though? I have no clue. Couldn't fucking tell you. And this is gonna be the room with the mask and shit, yeah? What if I do this? Okay, that doesn't do anything. Oh! Oh no, it does. No, I didn't know that. What are those? What's in here? Cash? Cash. Wait, I see, uh, like, when we were running away from the King Boo, these went into these rooms. Okay. So, there might be more... Will there be some here? No. I think it, it might be just in rooms where there's like mirrors and stuff. Okay. So that's first floor, it seems, because we can't go we can't go past here. Um, and to get here we need to get rid of that. So I guess that has to be triggered by the game. So I'm gonna go to floor five. Oh what the fuck? Get him, get him, get him, get him. Oh, I almost got hit. Can I please hit the other ghost? Yeah, there you go. That's a cool feature in my opinion. I can just smash ghosts into each other. Boom. Do I actually get anything from that? It lights up the room. Was that all? Because I saw like once we left this room, these cons appeared again. So is this place clear or not? Completely missed. Nice, Louis. Just get this dickhead here. Fuck the pumpkins. Oh, at least I got a heart from that. So hopefully this area is clear, but my my map doesn't indicate. Like, how am I supposed to know this is clear? Are they gonna fucking spawn again? Because that's gonna be hella annoying. All right, finally onto the fifth floor we go. Okay, we were already on this floor, I think. But he's calling me. What is this shit, bro? He just fucking puts it on his head. Luigi, I just remembered something important I neglected to mention. The Polar Geist, uh, the vacuum of yours has a new feature I like to call suction shot. It'll work as a weapon for you on your adventure. Press Y. Uh, to fire rubber plunger and then you can stick it and then you can suck it. I know this. So I pretty much can press Y now. Shoots this. I suck it. Press A. It breaks that. Can I do it to any surface? I fucking don't think so. Yeah. Like that, I can't move. Alright. Well, there's another vending machine. Oh. 
fuck this chair? All right, well, it seems like there's a room there, as you can see. But also another way of knowing is pulling down the poster. And bam. They are doing a lot of stuff there. Let's try, okay. Let, let, let's, I actually don't know how to get there. God damn. I should not explore. Let's explore a bit here. The fuck was that? I don't really think there's anything here. Might as well have a look though. Hello, is there a lady taking a shower? Oh, it's a spider taking a shower instead. Why is that drain so huge? Is that a drain? Oh, it is like a tunnel thing. You can see on the map. Oh, there's coins you can see in the reflection. Okay. Not much in this room. Okay, nice fucking prank, Vitali. Get that rat. There's golden rats as well. Suck them up. Money. See, it's worth exploring shit. Oh, what the fuck? I guess the plunger? Oh my god! It's a secret room! Oh god, there's a lot of spiders. I fucking hate this in real life if spiders were this big. Ugh. Okay, I think that's all that there is in this room, spider-wise. Okay, which one was it? Okay, it's X. Bro, it's... Nintendo controllers trip me out, bro, because it's like X is Y, and then Y is X, and then A is B, and then B is A. It's not like fucking Xbox, but I guess they couldn't do the same as Xbox, so it'd be fucking copying. It's like PlayStation has like triangles and other shit. Oh wait, there's a, there was a room I just missed out on, hold on. Ah, oh, rat! Stop fooling around, Luigi. Shut up, Egad, you... Dumb fuck, do it yourself. Let me collect money. You told me to collect money and now you're complaining about What is this? Oh. Wait, can I break that? <gasps> I'm a fucking genius. That's our first gem on floor five out of like 10. Right. Can look through here. Okay, I like how there's motion controls in here. I can just move my controller and I can look around. He's... All right, that's it. Yeah! Where's this cunt? Ghost! Okay, there doesn't seem to be anything here. I mean, there is a ghost, but... Maybe he dipped? I don't think it really matters anyway. Oh, jeez. So is this area fucking clear or not? Next stop, room 507. Oh, they were renovating this one. Fucking dust, man. What the hell? There's nothing there. Oh. Big brain. That's likely the only thing here. Maybe some cash. Is that another room, though? Oh no, it's just a closet. Cool. I think that's all that's in here. Let's go to the bathroom. This is a fucking mess. There's a spider there. He's erasing all the work they've done. Nice, Luigi. Is that Peach in there? No. There's something pink in there, though. Bro, can I get this fucking gold bar? Can I break it? Oh, I can. Bro, perfectly good toilet, bro. I can literally break everything. Why can't I break the mirror? Bro, literally, the mirror is the easiest thing. You can use the fucking plunger. Fuck off, Igad! Plunger? Destroy that. So much fucking money. Oh. 
Whoa! Uh -oh. Uh -oh. What does that do? Oh, money. Are they really gonna do all these cool ideas just for money? Not for finding girls and shit? I'm really, like, they, they give you so much money. I'm really wondering what role will this money play in this game? I think maybe... <sighs> I wouldn't be surprised if it's some, like, customizable shit and multiplayer and stuff, maybe. All right, it's finally time for EGAT's room. Huh? It's a boss. Do not touch that woman! <laughs> what? They can do that? Or what? They can... Fr oh, she can't! D okay, she can. Now that makes no fucking sense. Now they can take an object and make it a ghost object. What is this? Okay, wow, there's money in there. Okay. Is this a briefcase? Okay, nothing. I'm glad the game gives you that choice, though, like... Hey, try and break this object. Might actually have something in it, might not. What about this? Okay, now that breaks into pieces, but it has literally nothing in... Okay. This and this. Just money? Wait, hold on. I can I can shoot those. Luigi. Man, those coins are gonna despawn. Hi, Luigi. Sorry, I was busy and just got back to my desk. Did I miss anything important? What's the status of my briefcase? What? A ghost mate took off with it. That won't do. No, that won't do it at all. Don't just stand there. Go after her. Shut up. Shut up, Ige. What happens if I shoot it? Oh, it just has coins in there. Okay, let's go out to the balcony. Oh, this is a cool place. Oh, that's so cool. Oh! Wait, is that an ice one? Oh no, I can get him, right? I thought that was an ice ghost. I mean, he breaks into crystals. Whoa, he got a crystal! Yeah. <laughs> Yo! See, this is why I fucking go everywhere and explore everything, bro. If I... I could have played off like, nah, that's just a balcony, there's nothing here. But there is! And that did actually, like, kind of scare me. Him popping off. Yaga! <laughs> Man, fuck this telescope! Let's go to the bathroom. Hello? What the hell is that? He got. They find really creative ways to give you money. Not gonna lie. What about the radio? Yeah, dance. Dance, Luigi. <laughs> dance, Luigi, man. Hit the quad. <laughs> Alright, well, that's all here. We gotta find that woman. Ah, oh, ghost! Ah, oh. oh, ghost! Piss off, man. Piss off. Fuckers. 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 Get the fuck over here. Fuckers. Okay, now can we find this woman? Is she here? She is. Completely missed that, but it still lets me suck her. <laughs> Hot damn! Wait. Come on, suck it, Luigi. God damn! I literally totally did that by accident. That plunger thing. 
Shit. Fuck this bucket! Egot man, fucking in the middle of something. By the way, Luigi, here's a fun bit of trivia for you. Every time you go through a door, all of your progress up to that point is saved. But it might not be if you move too quickly from door to door to door to door, you get the idea, I'll say. Waiting 10 seconds should be enough. <laughs> you know what they say, patience is virtue, virtue. Keep up the good work. Piss off, man. Let me fucking capture this. I wouldn't say hot maid, but... Is she here? Get over here, man. Get over here! <laughs> Luigi just hit his toe against this. <laughs> okay, she's here. Guys, honestly, I'm gonna ask you guys, le leave in the comments, would you fuck this ghost? I'm kinda jealous of Luigi. She's acting like a boo right now. Like, in the first game, boos just go from room to room if you don't capture them. And one suck. I don't think she's here. Please be here. Yeah, she is here. Yes, we got her! She's super annoying. We got the briefcase! Oh. I wonder what's in there. I wonder if it's like a sex doll or something. Foldable sex doll? He made a f foldable fucking laboratory. Oh? Got it. Yeah. Luigi. Oh, yeah. Hehe, <laughs> <laughs> it seems that you also acquire a new elevator button. Also, bring my briefcase down. Come back. Let's go! I'm enjoying this game so far, not gonna lie. <laughs> Just stubs his toe again. It looks like you're, you're able to get to third floor. But bring my briefcase down first. Did I get this? How did I not get this? Bro, I got this already. Why did it reappear? What a fucking waste of time, man. I just want to try this first. I'm a genius. Okay. Welcome back, Luigi. My briefcase. Chop, chop. Hee, hee, hee. This is what I wanted. The time has come. I'm too old to be out catching ghosts by myself rather than give up on my ghostly pursuits. I thought I'd create a helper. What the fuck? Ladies and gentlemen, from the brilliant mind of Professor Egad, it's Guigi. The development process was a real challenge, to say the least. Fortunately, I had a little help from someone to test the prototype. Um, how is this going to help? Now, now, take it easy. Here, Luigi, I'm going to attach this to you. Uh, turn around. <laughs> Okay, it's all set up. Let's practice a bit. Follow me outside. Okay. So how is this gonna work? I guess Guiji can enter things I can't. Hehe, <laughs> I've caught you in my trap, Luigi, don't worry. I'm just kidding, but I am going to need you to stay locked up. Why you ask? Uh, because I want you to use Guiji to try and escape from your cell. You can activate Lu uh, Guiji by pressing the right trigger or right stick. Then he doesn't have a lot of health. This is your very own personal assistant, Guiji. Guiji can slip through sp tight spaces like gates and vents. His body is incredibly soft and malleable. It really... Quite amazing. Go on, see for yourself. Jesus. There you go. 
He moves in basically the same way you do, so controlling him shouldn't be that hard. Guiji is active, will let you switch between him and yourself. Remember that. Oh, he's dead. Hehe, <laughs> 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 Guiji isn't even remotely waterproof, Luigi. If he gets wet at all, he melts and disappears. What? Oh my god. Alright, there you go. Like I said before, you can switch between yourself, but yes, I know, while you're in the middle of doing some other action. You can quickly swap it. Yes, I know! Go, 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 go! I'm trying, man. God damn it. Go, Luigi! Okay, that time he didn't- he kept fucking sucking. Before he just stopped sucking and just let the fucking cage down. Alright, we're, we're done with your training. Let's go back to the lab. Nice work, Luigi. Very impressed. I must say that reminds me of something I wanted to tell you. I've been running the sensors in the lab and they detected the presence of a mysterious building. In fact, the ominous looking tower is very close. Uh, I know you really want to find all of your missing friends, but if you want to break from that, you could head over to the tower. Go on and test your skills there for science. I made re re rearrangements so you can access the tower from the lab. Just select scare scraper and multiplayer. Have fun. Oh wait, I just remembered something else. You can check out Scream Park if you're feeling alone, uh, a bit lonely and want to have. Oh my God! You can have eight people play. Okay, I don't have any friends, so anyway. Thank you guys for watching episode 2 of Luigi's Mansion 3. I, I think the rest of this let's play is going to be without a webcam. So, yep. Um, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in part 3. Peace.